Hi team. I want to discuss how to trick yourself into achieving goals. I want to discuss how you can achieve your fitness goals without even realizing. I know that some people struggle with motivation. I know that some people struggle with being held accountable or disciplining themselves and therefore need maybe someone else to help guide them or to help provide that discipline so that they can stick or be consistent to what they want to be consistent to so that they achieve their goals. So one of the ways that I trick people or trick myself, I use this method as well, into achieving my goals is to commit to a fitness specific goal. So is to commit to an end point. For example, HBF Fun Run, sign up for that. And then that gives me, okay, I've got 10 weeks to start training for this. All right, now I've got a plan together and now I've tricked myself into achieving that goal because now I've got focus, I've got direction and I've got a little bit of motivation because I don't want to get there, get to that end goal and then be like, oh, I can't even run 2Ks, you know? So a way that I love to trick myself into achieving my own goals is setting these fitness specific goals. So making a financial commitment to something, for example, True Grit, Tough Mudder, um, like an eight-week challenge, anything, to a powerlifting competition, right? That's how I like to trick myself is by being like, yes, this is something that I know I want to achieve. So I'm going to make a financial commitment. I've made a financial commitment by purchasing the entry ticket or to committing to whatever it may be. Then I can work backwards to set my goals so that I'm making weekly and then daily actions that I can take to bring me closer to that goal. And that's kind of how I trick myself. And then that helps me keep accountable. I also wanted to just discuss why I love challenges, especially for people that might not be able to find that motivation within themselves or that accountability within themselves to help them reach the goals that they so desperately want. I love eight week challenges because they provide focus, they provide direction, and they provide education. Well, mine do. Um, so having that direction, focus, and education creates momentum. And then it also helps to set up healthy habits. So sustainable healthy habits, so that you've got um, your end goal, you're able to achieve that, and then you're able to keep building upon that. And that's why I love things that create momentum. I love specific fitness goals and I love challenges for those reasons. Trick yourself. Trick yourself into achieving your own goals.